Kuzumo Zespa in my DeLorean. War is over on my pizza Mandalorian. The story is dumb. Star Wars historian Stephen DeBate thought they played at Ben against Ram Renegade. What's up, welders? Well, I hope you've watched the uh, video where I added the foot pedal mod to my Harbor Freight uh, 98233 TIG welder. In this one, we're going to switch the torch from that Abacor Benzel giant blue handled 17 style torch that came with the welder to a WP17F torch that I got off of eBay from Welding City for like $8.99. It's a really simple swap. Anybody can do it. This is a simple 10 minute job. All you need is a couple wrenches, maybe a knife. So there's the WP17F torch that I ordered off of eBay, and in the background you can see the uh, torch that came with it. I guess you call this a uh, European style torch. That handle's just unwieldy. Plus the 17F is a flex torch, I like that. This is a pretty simple swap. Take out some screws, remove a couple connectors, nothing to it. So first we'll remove the six screws and the uh, he head hardware. Start with the stubby cap, back cap. Then my number seven cup. Move the collet and tungsten. With a pair of pliers. Just give a slight tweak and remove the collet holder from the head of the torch. Just checking, because you never know. Ah, winner, winner. Ding, 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 ding. So we'll begin by removing the six fillet head, fillet head screws that hold the two halves of this case together. I begin by screwing counterclockwise. No, I'm not going to make you watch that. That's ridiculous. How about some magic? Magic. Where's the magic? There it goes. Now we can remove the torch body and the switch from the blue cam clamshell case. I'm just keeping everything, trying to keep all the parts together. I don't know why. I don't ever intend to use this again, but you never know. <laughs> My giant sausage fingers were not made for tiny little parts. Just moving the switch panel out of the way. You can see the connector there. It's the hex-shaped piece in the middle. They've got it covered in uh, black electrician's tape. I'm just going to peel that off. I guess they must not have trusted their um, connections over there in China. Pardon the train. All right, once we've got the tape off of there, we've revealed the connection. The part attached to the cable has just a flat spot ground on it. So I'm going to grab the actual torch. torch cable with the crescent wrench, loosen it with the channel locks and ba ba boom. It's loose and the torch head should twist directly off. 
say goodbye to my little friend. All right, so now we have the uh, cable, power cable ready. Here's our new torch handle, which we slip down over the gas hose and power cable. Notice that the unribbed part, the part not for her pleasure, is pointed toward the head of the torch. Here's the new torch head. Check, make sure the threads are clean and screw it into place. We're going to need our wrench combo to put a little torquage on it. This time I'm gripping the hose connector with the pliers using the crescent wrench on the new head because I want to put some torque on it. Make sure we got a nice seal. Looks good. Tighter than a frog's ass and just as waterproof. Slide the handle up into position on the torch head and viola. There we have it. I'm going to use a little bit of black electrical tape to uh, seal that rubber covering up where I sliced it so I can get down in there. I don't know if you can see that. Probably not. It says WP17F. Now we'll put the collet holder in, finger tight, and then just give it a little tweak so that we know she's tight. <clears throat> Drop in the collet and the tungsten from the behind. Screw on the number seven cup, which I use for 99% of everything I do. Set our tungsten length. And screw on the back cap. That's a tight fit. So we got it all screwed together now. Got a piece of uh, 3 8 out for your little test run. Light it up. See what she can do. I mean, there's no change to the uh, power or quality of the beads laid by switching these torch, head, torch heads. It's just more of a comfort factor for yours truly. I like to hold it like that. I'll hold it like this. Get myself adjusted. All right, let's light her up. And she works. Successful test.